Mr. Noor is uh, making the audio presentation uh, here, and uh, I am sharing the screen on behalf of him. So you can see and get the presentation in the screen and voice from my side. Uh, Mr. Noor, please speak a little louder. Uh, this is uh, Rasul Noor, uh, I am a teacher of uh, Rasul Noor, one and only. Um, uh, I am uh, now uh, here uh, to describe. Yeah, no, not, not, yeah. It is too low, Mr. John. We can't hear him. Yes, sir, just wait. Listen. Yes, next slide. Uh, Mr. Chanto? Yes. Uh, can, you, can you do me a favor? Uh, uh, can you scroll? Yes. Scroll, scroll the next slide. Next slide. Yes. Thank you. In the year 2012, uh, first time a food shop established uh, for poor people in Bangladesh. Uh, let's uh, know the detail about uh, this uh, food shop. Uh, uh, next slide, please. Bangladesh, uh, you know, Bangladesh is a small underdeveloped country of Asia. As uh, like other countries, it has also poverty problem. So many people are uh, poor and jobless. Uh, they are unable to feed themselves, so they have to beg. And uh, they involved with uh, begging. Uh, next slide, please. Uh, amazing, uh, there is an amazing fact uh, that is uh, some young artist, uh, artist, its main uh, uh, painting, a uh, painter of Bangladesh established an interesting idea to solve unemployment and a begging problem. They established a food shop where poor people can buy food package for one BDG. a very uh, minimum amount selling every food package in a minimum value of money of this country because the poor people can buy it easily and don't think it's a begging in bangladesh it is well known as one taka food this is my project name so that i told you before uh, that uh, uh, project one taka food that's name. Okay. Uh, one taka mean it's a one BDT that that's mean to uh, currency of uh, Bangladesh. One taka. As like uh, you guys, uh, some of you guys say that one dollar or uh, uh, one rupee. That's like uh, one BDT. One BDT it's equal to 0 0.012 USD. But uh, here is a problem. Every food package costs 50 BDT. But we are selling uh, the food packages uh, one BDT. So where is coming from the forty nine BDT? Okay, uh, uh, let's let's know about that. Uh, please next next slide, please. Next slide, please. yes. Uh, th thank you, Mister Mister Janto. Uh, the young artists sell their art and painting and arrange a risk of the money for feeding the underprivileged people who are suffering by hunger. The young artist is published and organized oh. uh, for exhibition and selling art and painting. Uh, oh. Please, sir, uh, next slide, please. Mm -hmm. Is not in here. Selling art and painting is not enough to earn money for large quantity of poor uh, foods. So, uh, where come from the money? By donation? No. 
begging cannot uh, uh, stop by donation because donation it's a type of uh, begging and uh, one type of food concept never support donation so the young artist involve all the poor people making craft item farming fishing and sell it uh, to the market under supervision of chobirak organization this is how thousands of poor people get caught. this is how thousands of poor people got uh, uh, get Next slide, please. Okay, okay. That, that slide, okay. But yes. Uh, uh, the story is not uh, not uh, ending here. Selling art and painting enough to earn money for large quantity for poor people. Uh, so where come from the money? Uh, so our our uh, uh, you you see you guys see that some people are uh, fishing uh, on the on on this slide and uh, some of uh, uh, some someone is uh, selling vegetable and uh, uh, one girl uh, is, is showing uh, a uh, ornaments uh, made by her. Uh, we are uh, uh, to help them uh, to uh, arrange uh, this uh, product. To sell uh, uh, to the market and uh, earn money. Uh, uh, next slide, please. From the year 2012, there are 850 beggars uh, gave up for begging and uh, joined with uh, the Chobirhat organization. Our earning oriented work. So, not only these 850 beggars, uh, uh, there are uh, 12. Hundred jobless are working with Chobirhat organization as a regular worker. Next slide, please. In Bangladesh, poor people's food shop, one taka food, is very popular because poor people not only getting food for one taka or one BDT, also getting job who are jobless. Uh, this is not only an uh, this is this is not only an activities. Uh, this is an idea which can change the society. At the present time, some of social workers from India and Nepal are started helping underprivileged people of those countries by our concept. This is not uh, not the end. Uh, some social workers from Syria, Afghanistan, and part from Africa are trying to establish this concept for the poor people of that country. Uh, that, that, that was the story of Project One Taka Food. Uh, thank you all for giving me the chance to share our concept with you. Uh, you guys